Well, welcome back. Right now, there is so much interest in going vegan. And now we have the world's first vegan cooking competition show with an all vegan celebrity cast. It is called Peeled, and Chef Chris Tucker is a judge on the show. Chris, thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for having me. This is really exciting. I mean, those cooking shows are so popular, the contests are so popular. Tell me a little bit about this show and what makes it so unique. Well, what makes our show unique is that we are the first of its kind. We have an entirely vegan cast, crew, down to our makeup person on the set. Wow. Everybody, every element of the show is completely vegan. And so um, it really sets us apart in the space of um, culinary cooking competitions that are in the market right now. Mm -hmm. And you are cooking up something very special for us today. Tell yeah. us what we're making. So I wanted to just pull a recipe that's really, really simple so everybody at home could possibly replicate it. Today I'm going to show you how to make crab cakes. Super easy, super delicious. You could fool anybody. We're going to start okay. with some hearts of palm mm -hmm. that I've just crushed up with my hands. Okay. I've already sauteed some peppers and some onions and garlic. They're going to go into that bowl with some spices. It's are all about the peppers, spices. Chris? Bell peppers? These are bell peppers. Okay. Yep, they're red, yellow, and orange. Okay. And then um, I put the spices in there. That's the key to this. It's Old Bay. It's Cajun seasoning. Yum. And it's also a little bit of seaweed flakes. That's going to give the fishy flavor. Okay. And then we're just going to go in with a little bit of flour. Bind and it all together. Once yep. we bind it all up, mix it together, we get this. This is what we have. Okay. Yeah. And it looks just like a crab cake it mixture. It really does. Yeah. And then you just form the crab cakes. Okay. So do I get that honor? You get the honor of forming the crab cakes today. Oh, scoop here. Just do a good scoop of that. How about that? Is that's that too perfect. big? No, that's okay. perfect. What's great about this too is you can make these any size you want. You mm -hmm. could do them really small for a bite-sized appetizer. You could create them a little bit larger and make a uh, crab cake sandwich out of it. Ooh. So it really just depends on what you want to go for with this type of dish. It smells so good. <laughs> it's really tasty. And then you just give them a little bit of a pat down. Mold them. You, you pop them in the fridge to cool for a little bit. Okay. And then you're going to bread them with some flour and panko breadcrumbs. Okay. After that, that's what we're that's looking what we at have here. here. Okay. Yeah, these have been coated with our flour and our panko. Mm -hmm. And then um, after that, you pan fry them. So really simple. Yeah, these look just like crab based crab cakes. Just like crab based crab cakes. Oh my cakes gosh, indeed. and they smell delicious. Yeah, and honestly, this is one of those things that you put it with a really nice ramelade sauce, mm -hmm. people will never know what they're eating. Yeah. And it's also a more um, inexpensive way to create that elevated crab cake experience if you're having a dinner party, mm -hmm. but you're trying to keep the budget low. So even if you're not plant-based, you might want to do this just if you're watching your budget. Yeah, it's, it smells delicious. It looks beautiful. Thank you, yeah. It looks so fancy. Yeah, you know, you can really show <laughs> the stop. The micro with, greens. Yep, yeah. show stop with some plant-based alternatives. Um, as you said, our show is premiering. Mm -hmm. We have a few VIP tickets left. Okay. We're premiering at the DGA here in Hollywood tomorrow. Okay. We have a few VIP tickets left for the event, so we're hoping for a massive turnout and a lot of press, mm -hmm. a lot of red carpet experiences, so that VIP ticket is going to allow people that Hollywood access that they don't normally get when there's red carpet events in town. And Chris, before we let you go, what else can we expect on this show? You can expect it to be compassionate towards the animals, but we're not we're not necessarily <laughs> compassionate towards um, our, our competitors. We're, I see. We okay. Are, we are really tough critics. Really tough with them because we want them to know that we're looking for the next hottest vegan chef. And in order for that title to be crowned to them, we expect a lot. Okay, I yeah. can't wait to see it. Thank you so much. And I'm going to have one of these when we go to commercial. Sounds great. Well, thank you again so much for joining us, Chris. Again, the show is called Peeled, and it premieres tomorrow on streaming platforms. And you can find out much more about Peeled and Chef Chris Tucker by going to our website, kkl9.com, and clicking on Scene on TV.